What's up world, I'm Mr. Vaca, and you might have heard yesterday that Google Meet has launched for its enterprise users breakout rooms, something that we have been requesting for a very long time. And since its launch yesterday, I have been receiving a ton of questions. So for today's video, I'm going to review all of the most frequently asked questions and give you a basic guide to breakout rooms. If you go to the Google Workspace update blog, you'll see the new article that was posted yesterday where it lets everyone know that the organizers or the host of the Google Meet that are enterprise for education users will now have this breakout room features. And here's why you'd use it. Naturally, it's one of the most highly requested features. Educators can offer increased engagement in their classes by splitting students up for simultaneous small group discussions or working time. The moderators can also jump between breakout rooms to monitor and participate in discussions. Now here's some additional details that will answer a lot of the questions I received. You can create up to a hundred breakout rooms in one Google Meet call. The call participants will then be randomly and equally distributed across the rooms. You can also manually move people into different rooms. If you need more help, click the Help Center link right there. While only event creators can create breakout rooms, anyone with a Google account that is joining from the web or through the Meet app can still be a participant. You can see here in Google's little video that with the breakout rooms, you can see how many breakout rooms you want. There's a timer. It shows you who's in the breakout room and it's very easy to jump and join between them. The last thing I want to mention is that if you are an Enterprise for Education user and you haven't seen this breakout room yet, don't stress, don't worry, it's coming. The way that Google rolls out these updates is that it's a two week period. So one school district, maybe school district A, will get it tomorrow, but school district B might not get it for a week and a half. So there is no rhyme or reason, doesn't make sense, but just know it's coming. And that wraps it up. So if you have any questions, please drop it down in the box below. Leave a thumbs up if you like the video, hit subscribe, that notification bell, share with your friends, it helps out the channel a ton. Most importantly, don't forget to work hard, play hard, and I'll catch you next time.